Well, the Congregation of Notre Dame is a non-governmental organization, which means basically it's a not-for-profit, and in that capacity we can have a relationship with the United Nations. We are related through the Department of Public Information, which basically serves to make known the issues before the UN and the importance of the UN itself. And then also uh, it's an opportunity for communities, any other kind of not-for-profit, say Save the Children or um, the United Way, there's all kinds, uh, to bring some information back in terms of asking for briefings or more information about certain issues. Now this that was the original status of the UN, of uh, the CNDs at the UN. In the 2000s, there was a shift and to give uh, access to the NGOs to have a little more input. And that comes about through the Economic and Social Council of the UN, which is an actual organ of the UN. Um, so we did not go for that status immediately, um, and partially because we only had part-time representation. And when we made the decision to do it in, the, in I think it was 2004, uh, or we were looking at it seriously, the decision was made instead to set up our justice and peace larger network, uh, which I think was a good move. And also to join a newly forming NGO, a coalition of congregations, and that's Unanima. Through our connection there, we have access to the Economic and Social Council of the UN. So through Unanima, we can actually sometimes submit issues or submit statements. We can attend commission meetings uh, and bring input from our people in a, on the ground, as they say, at the UN. So what we hear back from say our people in uh, El Salvador or things that might be happening in the Cameroon or uh, here in Canada or wherever or in the United States but um, so it's more access um, but that capacity is through Unanima and that's why that's important uh, very important and it's probably not a bad thing to be in a collaborative uh, network that way given the changes that are happening in religious congregations um, it might proved to be a very providential decision. So, so I work in both capacities. <laughs>